Hello everyone, welcome back and this is Naveen from UI Brains. So in this video, we are going to discuss another card of Bootstrap. So that is uh, how to display uh, a registration form or login form with the cards. So let's have a look how to display such type of cards uh, in Bootstrap. Okay, so display a registration form inside a card. So let's see here. So uh, let me copy the starter file. I will create a new here. I just paste it 20 underscore BS underscore um, registration underscore card. Some registration card. Okay. Let me change the title as well. This is as a registration card. Okay. So here. Mm, let me open that this is the last class and uh, open that yep so here I'm gonna take a card but before I discuss about the card we need a very narrow card so very narrow card means you have to give the grid system columns I need just four column layouts card it will be like this let's take a row in one single row in that I will take a, a column it is of four columns layout. You can write call MD4. It is like this row and four columns. In that, I'll take a card. So one card. In that, I will take a card header. So let's check. So I got a card header and I also take the card body. So I write card minus body tab. Okay, I got a header as well as the body so header i will give some caption i will give the class call bg um, bg primary and the text uh, white and i'll take a text uh, center and let me write a caption i write some h3 uh, register this is a register okay register here fine and below this i want to write uh, a form so we have learned already form tags so let me write a forms form in that i'll take uh, a text box so i will write a division with the class call form group inside i'll take an input type text give the class call form control and let's make a placeholder let's take a user name okay you get a username box and then uh, i will copy this i will paste it i'll take another field that's a email and this is going to be the email and i'll take another field that's a password i'll copy this i'll paste it this is gonna be the password and this is going to be the password and i'll take another field that's a confirm password so password only and uh, uh, placeholder is going to be the confirm password okay so this is a form and inside i'll take another button to submit the form so i will take another division with the class call form uh, let's take a not form text center here i take uh, input type is equal to submit value goes to uh, register and I'll give the class call btn btn minus primary so you will get a nice registration form and uh, the card body if you want to give some colors uh, for card body you can give the pg light you can give so it looks like this okay or else you want to give any light color light blue color background so better you go with your custom classes pg light blue so i'll take my own custom class and then just give some styles go to a style tag so dot bg light blue let me give some background color light blue color so it is going to apply the light blue color of the form okay so it is a card header and it's a card body in the card body we have a 
all the fields and one registration form okay so and you want to give some animations uh, you can also give some animations uh, for the whole card I will give animated is a class uh, which is coming from mdb.css in built uh, in mdb.css if you are using mdb it works if you are not using mdb we are using only bootstrap then better you add uh, one uh, one file called animate.css just you can search in uh, google you can add that and you can start using the same class name so animated i'll add zello so your card is applied with a zello or let's make uh, a class called jack in the box so yes so when you refresh yes okay so this is a card in this lastly i want to tell you why this card is has, has come exactly this much width is i have given call md4 is a four column layout if i give something three column layout see a very narrower card if i give this five column layout it's a very wider card if you take a six column layout is it is like this okay so how to adjust its width and heights is using the grid system so i made it as four so it's a four columns so totally in one row we have 12 columns so i just made a four column layout okay so this is about a card uh, with a form okay so that's it thank you so much for watching and well made in the next video thank you mm -hmm.